hey girlfriends welcome back to the channel for another video this week if you're new here my name is Jeronica Maicia but all my friends call me G and if you're a returning subscriber thanks for coming back this week and clicking on my face and if you haven't already go ahead and give this video a big thumbs up like share comment subscribe and do not forget to follow me over on Instagram for all of the fabulous updates and come back each week for weekly uploads so today I have a fun video but a very informative video today I'm going to be sharing a few brands that I feel like will be great for you guys to try out and shop for like your spring summer wardrobe pieces now each um brand that i'm going to name they you may have heard of them or you may have not each brand gives you like a totally different vibe so this these are just a few brands that i feel like you should just keep your eyes out for like every year i know the seasons are going to change honestly these are the i believe i have five here these are the five brands that i always run to to see what's new what they're putting out and i'm always pleased and satisfied and actually i have a few pieces from different brands that i'm going to be sharing or showing you guys as we talk about them and if i don't have anything from the brand I'll still give my opinion on it and also put some pictures and stuff on the screen so you guys can be informed and see what's going on girl so if you want to see this video just keep watching all right so the first brand I'm going to be sharing is Petite Courage now I I believe that's how you pronounce it but I found this brand last year um, on Farfetch I was instantly obsessed because I keep telling you guys I love adding fun spring summer bags into my wardrobe because I started to realize I wasn't really wearing a lot of my luxe bags in the summertime if I if it's not a mini bag or something very small and cute I wasn't really reaching for my luxe bags anymore I was literally reaching for about two or three bags so I was like I want to add more fun vibrant bags that maybe don't have like the logos and monograms and stuff and I'm so happy I found this brand this is definitely a brand every season well I've only been knowing about them since last year but every season I'll be looking for them and I'm gonna share the ones I have. Now, I wanna say this is a Haitian brand, and y'all, I love these bags. They come in these dust bags, like this, and you pull them out, and they're these fun, very, very fun, vibrant colors. Look at that. That is so pretty. Like, this is like a statement piece that you would just pop any look with. Now, it also comes with a crossbody strap that you can add to the bag if you like, and in the inside, I just learned this <laughs> um the, it comes with this little pouch now these little satin pouches is to put your stuff well you put it in the bag and then you put your stuff in it so the stuff don't fall out y'all I'm obsessed with these bags look how gorgeous this is this is just something fun you can just just play around and crossbody y'all this bag look amazing like if you put it on crossbody it kind of like falls like this and the straps will be on it and well usually I do it this way so the um inside tag doesn't show and it just be crossbody y'all these are so so good so i have this one i also ordered another one from farfetch but it's not um in on time for the video but i still want to share with these with you guys and uh, girl so good and another thing about this brand the prices are very very good price points i actually just got one from farfetch on sale it was like 60 percent. i want to say i know i paid like 118 dollars for it and that's really good but i think these right here are maybe like 250 i want to make sure if i remember i'm going to put it on the screen but also super cute this one has the white strap with the white um bag on the inside and I don't know, in a, since I've had these, like in the spring summertime of last year, I pulled these out a lot because it was just really that piece that just popped my outfits and just pulled the look together and I'm very pleased with them. With these bags, I also see this year, they're doing more of a monochromatic vibe, which I love. They have a nude one that I really, really um, want. Now this is the one that I just got in literally yesterday from um, Farfetch and this is the one that I got on sale for 118. I'm gonna link some down below so you can check the description description box. Um, this one has the black strap. I thought this was just fun. It's kind of like a, a good play on a neutral because I have like the brown, well, the taupe fringes with the black fish netted bag. This is gorgeous. The craftsmanship on these bags, y'all, I cannot lie. Everything is just amazing. And I'm constantly telling people about this because I feel like everybody wanna run to like the big names but the funniest and the most unique pieces that everybody always asks me about are literally from like small brands or brands that's not really 
mainstream but i feel like this brand last year i'm not sure how new the brand is but they were like new and now this year i'm seeing them more i was actually in um sex and i saw a lady with one on and of course i had to run to farfetch and um pick it up but i'm gonna put it on the screen the one that i'm waiting for right now like i said these bags the price point it's great the quality amazing I, i'm just like obsessed and i love the fact that there's something for everyone if you're not really a color girl they're doing a very um good job with the monochromatic bag so you could definitely try that out but me personally with these bags i find the two-tone colors i think they're so fun they're so fun anytime i wear these bags people are stopping me where did you get this it's so fun and i love the fact that it can be a top handle if i like the um straps are detachable so if i don't want to wear the strap i don't have to um many times i'll go out and i'm like oh, i want to hold it like this but you know once you start enjoying yourself having fun if i go to um festivals or anything like that i probably don't want to hold this on my um hand anymore but it does really good as let me see it just pop right on very comfortable but i started to carry the strap with me by the strap being so thin i just roll it up put it in there so when i want to pop the strap on and do it crossbody i don't have any issues but this is definitely a brand i would recommend checking out even if you want to just try out one bag but i promise you once you get one you're going to start looking and um constantly buy so last year i purchased two this year i purchased two and there's a few more on my radar that i want to try out because these bags this is something that's very timeless and also something that i'm gonna just have in my um my wardrobe for years to come this is so fun it just gives you look at this Ugh, it's the fringe for me it is the fringe and that's another thing that i'm seeing lately well i feel like fringe is something that would never go out of style whether you have a fringe jacket a fringe dress a fringe bag boots anything fringes timeless in a wardrobe so and it's just like that fun statement piece that's just a little little literally break necks and girl when i saw this one i had to have it it was just these are so good so definitely a brand that i would definitely say check out i'm gonna um link as many in the description box below so yeah now, the next brand is also a brand you guys constantly hear me talking about lately and that is cult gaia now i talk about cult gaia a lot because i honestly love the brand i love the price points and i love how unique their pieces are this is a brand each year i may not buy a lot of pieces from them i don't think I, anytime i'm shopping i like to buy pieces that i know will mix well in the, my wardrobe with the pieces i already have so each year i may buy like two pieces from this brand three pieces from this brand you don't have to like shop and buy a whole bunch of things but cult gaia is definitely a brand i check out every single year when it's about to be like spring summer or when i know i'm going on a tropical vacation i love to check out the brand because they have like i said unique pieces now they ha they don't do like traditional summer fashions it definitely gives you like mexico to loom vibes very tropical but still edgy and unique i absolutely love the designs called gaia was definitely famous for the arc bag you know the bamboo bags that everybody has but with called gaia this is also a brand that usually is included in most sales like at um sags neiman's um all of the places like that because you know a lot of brands they do like exclusions to certain um designers but called gaia is usually always included in sales so if you want to you can always wait for a sale to come i usually try to wait for different sales like i know um around this time sex um do family and friends which they, which they just had and they had a great selection of pieces from cult gaia i just feel like this is definitely a brand that i always recommend to people when you're trying to add statement pieces to your wardrobe that you can constantly go back to each year like that's what i'm really into now when i shop i shop for pieces that i'm going to want to wear next year the year after that like five years from now and if we've been honest y'all i just changed over my wardrobe to my spring summer stuff and i just feel like oh my god i feel like i'm excited and i have like a whole new wardrobe because i have been so intentional with shopping with different brands and just trying new things but also buying pieces that i know i'm gonna love and want to wear years from now so this is a brand that i would say 
check out. If you want to check out a brand, I would always suggest go into Saks. It doesn't cost you anything to try things on. Do not be afraid to go up in there and try things on, girl. You you are a paying customer. You can try things on, okay? Um, Go in, try things on, see what you like. That's what I usually do because with different brands, the sizing is completely different. I could be a 6 in this brand. I could be a 14 over here. It's just completely different, so I like to go in, check out the material, see the sizing. Like, I will always suggest go in and just check it out. But right now, Colgaia is definitely a brand that's on my radar, but they're on my radar every year that's why I have them on this list and they just have fun pieces but let me show you guys these shoes that I have it comes first of all oh jeez I literally just broke my nail that's so tragic um comes in this gorgeous box I love the packaging I'm always obsessed with Coke Guy's packaging and they're these fun 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 um chunky shoes now one thing about kogai they're really famous for like using woods and like neutral tones i love that these y'all know i love me a platform girl i love a good platform and these are just so fun unique and this is something that you're just not going to be walking on the street and see everybody wearing i love them they have like this very thin strappy um lace up sandal type vibe so cute and i love the play on the different neutrals like they did like a and this is wood they did like a dark wood and more of like a brown oh, this is just so fun look at the heel and on the back i don't know if you can see it has like that little let me see it has like this little arch oh i thought this was super cute when i saw these I had to have them now one thing i realized about the brand i got these shoes in the 39 and a half i could have gotten a 40 so next time i think i'm going to get a 40 to see if these shoes run small because i'm a regular 39 if i would have got these shoes in the 39 they would have them fit these are exact so i would have preferred them in a 40 but this is something i've been having these since they came out maybe 2018 2019 every year i'm still pulling them out every time i wear them people are still stopping me like oh my god these are so good where did you get these who are they by call guy your girl this is a good shoe look at the detailing at the front oh can you see look at that it's just so good i love the platform the platform is like very high but you don't feel the height as you can see because look at this look how small that arch is these shoes are so comfortable girl that's why i'm always picking them up anytime i'm going on vacation or going anywhere i always pick these up because this is my go-to summer sandal now the next brand i have on my list is star now with this brand i usually check them out for like um fall winter pieces when it's like in the cooler months i've never really paid attention to them for like spring summer pieces but this year i'm really into their spring summer pieces and i do look for i don't own anything by the brand but that will definitely change this year because i was scrolling on sags during the family and friends and they popped up and i was like oh my god this is fun what is this i just kept going deeper and deeper into like this rabbit hole and y'all they have some really fun things out they're doing a great job with uh, color blocking i love uh, brands that color block for me because color blocking can get tricky okay sometimes you don't want to do all that work certain colors don't pair well together and the pieces that they're mixing i like the way they're color blocking it's kind of like a ombre they, they're doing really good with like ombre color blocking and i'm really into like a monochromatic ombre they have like a lot of nice two-piece sets and a lot of pieces that you can go to each year like if you invest in something from the brand i feel like these are pieces that you'll have in your wardrobe and you'll constantly go back to them each and every um season well spring summer seasons now with this brand i don't know um how the sizing runs so that's why i'm going into sex to try this on instead of um buying it on online i would rather go in the store to you know just see because i if i miss out on this dress i'm gonna be hurt i'm gonna try to put the pieces that i'm gonna um be trying on and trying to get i'm gonna put them on the screen they have this orange two-piece nylon set i think this dress well this two-piece set is like a crop top with like the nylon shorts i think that's gonna look so good on my skin in the summertime because i feel like orange looks so good on the girls with melanin okay i love it it just makes you look golden and just it just radiates off of the skin so i look forward to trying that on now that's why i didn't want to try the shorts on because i feel like the shorts it can get tricky over here okay the thighs start rubbing and i ain't got time for the shorts to be moving so i need to go into sex and see what the girls are giving and they also have this black dress i don't need another black dress but this dress is 
so good okay it has like this halter top neck detailing with a little cutout y'all know i told y'all right now cutouts this um season is like on trend the back is like it's kind of like a peekable cutout i love that for me and this is just a piece that i feel like i don't mind investing in because it's that light breathable cotton and i just feel like this is a timeless piece that i'll have in my wardrobe so this is definitely a brand that we'll be checking out together but you can definitely just check out uh, i'm gonna link some pieces down below just check them out or if you ever in the mall girl go to Saks and just try some pieces on like i said because trying on clothes ain't never hurt nobody but i feel like they, right now they're doing really good with some fun spring summer timeless pieces all right so the next brand i have is gia borgani um i'm gonna have the name on the screen my girl and i actually have uh two pairs of shoes from this brand now this is a collab let me put one down this is a collab that she did and i got these from farfetch within this brand i get my regular size which is a 39. now with this brand i feel like they also do a really good job with nice shoes that you'll have in your collection for years to come and i also love the heel height now i got these oh look how gorgeous I actually have two pairs. Let's just get them. Um, I got the white first. No, I think I got both of the both of these at the same time. Now these shoes, if they are still available, I'm gonna link these down below. I don't know if these are available because, like I said, these were a collab that they did. I got these during quarantine, girl. So. And I'm sure you guys have seen these. They were very famous and popular for the brown in these, like the brown and the neutrals. But I also see this year they have like red and other colors. But these are the two I have. And I love, look at the heel height, girl. They'll still give you, oh, they still give you like a fun, sexy little heel. Not like too much of a kitten heel. Because, I, girl, I'm just not a kitten heel type of girl. But still, like, I can do brunch in these. Like a cute little lunch. I can shop in these. These shoes are very, very comfortable. I absolutely love the fact that if when I walk a lot, my feet, they swell up, girl. And on these shoes, you can adjust the, um... The vel these are velcro you can adjust the straps to your liking i'm obsessed and this one is a leather now i've always wanted white shoes this was my introduction to white shoes i've always been a no no when it comes to white shoes you don't wear white shoes white shoes just gives me like country vibes but i started to be like i want to try white shoes and this was my introduction so i cannot lie i'm a fan of white shoes now um now with this brand i can't speak for other shoes i don't know how comfortable they are but for the ones that i have these shoes have been comfortable last year was that last year last year these girl these were my go-to okay these are my go-to i love the fact that the heel height wasn't too high i can't do like if i'm trying to like be cute go to brunch i want to you know feel comfortable and confident the heel height was perfect for me to like do a cute little all day vibe they don't hurt my feet and they're just good i like the these are padded i don't know if you can see that detailing but these are padded and it's just a fun shoe this year they have um they just released a shoe that i want to try on i don't know if i'm going to buy them i'm gonna put them on the screen i don't know if i want to buy them because i'm not really a in between the toe type of girl i just can't get with that vibe anytime i try to buy a shoe that has anything between the toe it just drives me crazy but i would like to try these on because i like anything that's going to have like a little around the ankle detailing so yeah i want to definitely try those on just to see what they're giving and see if it's going to aggravate me now when it comes to price point i don't feel like the price point is just too crazy out there but you still get like a very nice quality shoe it's not i'm not gonna say these, the price point is like super affordable but i cannot lie the pair that i have right now that's why i'm willing to invest more into the brand because i like what they're doing i like the fact that these are um classic designs it's not too trendy this is a shoe that i can have in my wardrobe for years and years to come but it still gives you fashion girl and not too dated but it's not like too trendy to where i get tired of seeing it if you know what i mean just a fun shoe and most of the shoes that they have that when i was on their website i usually buy my shoes from them from farfetch i'm always intrigued with the brand and with the shoes the heels they're always doing something that some of their shoes do remind me of like a cult gaia vibe maybe they that's why I gravi gravitate to this brand more because it does give me like a slight cult guy vibe. But 
I think this is a brand that you should definitely keep your eye out for. I've never seen this brand sold in any stores. Um, I did see like a few pair in like this boutique in Soho, but I don't know if that was just like a um, pop-up type thing, uh, situation. I haven't seen these in like a Saks or Neiman's or anything, but you can also buy them online if they don't work for you. You can return them, but definitely just browse. Like I said, just how it don't kill nobody to try something on, it doesn't kill you to browse. Just keep this brand on your radar. If you're in the market for some new summer sandals, definitely check them out because they have timeless pieces that I feel like they're very flattering on the foot and they're comfortable. We need to be comfortable in the summertime, girl. If you're like me, your feet just be all big and tired. We need to be comfortable, okay? Now the last brand on my list, I have Fee Noel. I also do not own anything from this brand, but that's gonna change this year also. And that's because I was able to go into Saks and try it on, y'all. When I saw that the brand was sold in Saks, I was so proud because I have been following and keeping up with this brand since they were like a small brand. And I'm like, oh my God, I've always been obsessed with the pieces. I think these pieces of, girl, just pieces that just break necks, like mouth dropping. And when I was able to try the pieces on at Saks, I was just, First of all, I felt proud because I'm like, okay, girl, y'all move it up, okay? And also, the quality. I was, I didn't doubt the brand, but me, I like to see things in person. It's just a different experience when you get to try things on in person, like touch um, the fabrics and see. I'm one of them girls. I don't just touch the fabric. I turn things inside out. I like to look at the, uh, the stitching. I can get a little nitpicky, I guess you could say. And that's why I enjoy seeing things in person. And when I was able to try the the kimono on I was just like oh my god I was obsessed so this year I want to definitely invest in a bathing suit from this brand I want to get um, a two-piece set and they have this new dress that I am just like oh yes oh yes it's this it gives you like a fishnet vibe with like a little um puff detailing on the sleeve they have it in white and they have it in mint green i already have a mint green dress similar to this but i personally feel like that mint green will look so good on my skin so i will go for the mint green over the white but i definitely want to get a kimono it's so many different pieces from this brand that i would just say girl just just try anything i they don't have anything that i'm just like okay i don't like this this is not for me. During quarantine, I watched their um, runway show and it just made me definitely become um, more of a fan. They have these hot pants. They look like a mini skirt, but it's shorts. It's just so many fun pieces that I feel like anytime I see somebody with it on, it's very flattering on the body, different body types. I love when a brand creates pieces that fits different body types. Now, when I was in sex, I was going to get the um, bathing suit. It's kind of like, I'm going to put one on the screen if I can. I'm sure I can. Um, With the puff sleeves, I would have liked to um, go up in the size because it was just giving me a little too much cheeky, cheek, cheek vibes. And that wasn't really what I was going for at the family pool, girl. So, I definitely want that. Um, I would love that in a peach or an orange. Some something about summertime, y'all. I just feel like I look my best in orange. Like orange is just my summertime color, and I just want everything in orange. But this brand is definitely a brand I look forward to checking out this year. And also, I feel like you guys should support and check it out. Um, the price point, hmm, I'm not gonna. It's not crazy. It's not crazy, but this is a brand. I like to invest in piece at a time. I don't go and just make like a whole big, uh, like a completely big order. I like get a piece here, get a piece there, get a piece here. The next thing you know, I got a collection of things. Actually, that's just how I shop in general, but I look forward to adding some of the Fee Noel pieces to my collection because I honestly, I'm just obsessed. And I feel like it's time. It's definitely time and this brand also gives you Caribbean vibes give you summertime like I'm just outside and then with the bathing suit the only reason I'm really investing in the swimsuit because the swimsuit can also be um, worn as a bodysuit so it's like a two-in-one the fact that I could wear it as a bathing suit or a bodysuit I feel like the cost for wear is just there okay so definitely a brand that I would say keep your eye out for follow them on Instagram and they may be in your local sex because when I was in Houston that's when I tried it on at um sex so all right girlfriends so that is all that i have for this video i hope that this video was helpful fun informative all of the things and comment down below i want to know what brands are you trying out this spring summer 
put us on we all need to be in the comments telling each other because i can't lie in the comments i have been learning about a lot of different shoe brands and different contemporary brands from you guys so definitely check out the comment box leave a cute little comment on different brands that we all should be checking out because i don't need to be the only one putting the girls on sometimes y'all be putting me on so now before you leave do not forget to like the video okay i'm not gonna go in my whole spiel about liking the video but i would greatly appreciate if you like the video and you come back for the next one